Hello everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome to episode 6 of our Blaze Survival. So, um, it's night time, I don't know where Ryan's went. Ryan, are you at the field? Maybe. Yeah, I've went there. Ryan died not that long ago to an enemy. I can see... Is that a decoy or a fool? It's a decoy hollow. Well, bitch. Better to die. It went to you. Oh god, he is fairly strong. Grand Fisher does about two and a half hit parts per hit. It's not bad. Not bad. I don't know if that was with my Rijitsu blocking it though. I don't, I don't think I lost any. Fucking spiders. That's a creeper. That's a creeper. Alright, well I made that little room that I had underneath my house but a little bit bigger. Hopefully now there's some more what like... Oh god, three skeletons. I think skeleton. I actually fear skeletons more than I fear some hollows. Like snake hollows, I've never bothered with. Blaze hollows, I've never bothered with. Bats are like the scariest thing in this earth. You all right? Yeah, just half a heart. Yeah. All right. No, no you've got one heart now. It's got leather right. pants. You're recovering. Well, let's stick together. Slowly. There's nothing here. No. Which annoys me. Uh, things can just spawn in randomly, so we just need to mm. have a look around. Let's keep running back and forward across yeah, the run, run back to the house and see if anything spawned over there now. I can reload the bits for there. I'm going to try over this bit. That is a brown sheep. That's a grey sheep. I saw the back of a grey sheep and thought it may have been some kind of hollow, but no, I'm not that lucky. No. Okay, where... Sheep are the new hollows. We must fear them. Image a game where sheep actually attack you. <laughs> Image a Minecraft like that. Simply terrify. I've got some seeds. We need to make a bigger farm. Like we should build like an extended bit up in the air with like a like, massive fucking farm or something. God, I can see three creepers. Oh, the creepers. I had 14 steak not long ago, I've got none now. I've got 29. How is this bullshit fair? Now I'll go grab my fish. Thank you. Okay, so we've got tons of leather. If we just go get some obsidian, we can get an enchant table, no bother. We just need to go down and mine for it. So now I might do that, like, in between episodes, I'll have a look around on the ground and see what's around. Or I might just do it next episode, I don't know. I might do this episode. I haven't decided yet. Um, no. okay. All we need to do is keep. We just need to keep those two cows. At least two cows in the area we're in. We don't need to. Is that a hole? Or a? That's a decoy. Die, decoy! Oh fuck! Hey! Die, you son of! Stop it! Oh god! Son. It's like actually I've got a blaze hole and a uh, grand fisher. After me, I'm not recovering health. <laughs> Could really use a hand right about now, Ryan. Wait, where are you? I'm on the path going home. I have, a, I have a blaze hole on my ass. And I'm on three hearts and I'm not recovering. Okay, I'm gonna eat this zombie brint. Ah. It's something. Sandra. The creeper did 10 damage to the blaze hollow. Hmm. I, I, I got it. it. Sounds like there's more of them in the area though. <laughs> Sander just loves answering back to you. Or like Sander's like, oh, can I help you? Hmm. He's probably lost half his brain cells though because he slapped him in his head. I think that was Zach. He used to get slapped a lot and he did things wrong so he knew not to do them again. It worked. But now he's daft as hell sometimes. Well, he does open the doors with his head quite a lot. It's some frightening speeds, I might add, sometimes. The thing is, Anders got a thick head, so it doesn't bother him. Well, yeah, Zach's a staffy, so he naturally has a, a hard <coughs> skill as well. Hey! Fish! Eat the fish. I have no freaking yeah. option but to do that. Uh, once again, another night without any luck. And just if you see any Grand Fisher ones, you should get a bow and just shoot them to activate them. Then 
to wreck their ass. Pretty much easy for them. Now you then commence to use, or sorry, you can then continue to use your boat and <laughs> the Then switch tactics and go with the old sword. Soundless is so annoying. He knows he's doing wrong. You turn around and you, like, all I need to do is lift up my hand and he knows, alright, I'm doing something wrong. As soon as I turn around, he goes, arr, arr. I guess more of a big fuck you, he's saying. Smart bastard. That smug bastard. I never said smart. I know. No, smug. I said smart. He's being smug. Frick. I'm in the fields and there's fucking nothing anywhere. Well, oh. it is daytime technically. What yep. we need to do, right, is we need to build a ginormous underground bit. Well, I think it is. No, it's just flowers not loading incorrectly. Oh. oh no, it's a golem! <laughs> well, happy days. I was walking top of him. Coming round just in case. Luckily with the rain it shouldn't. Uh oh. Damn it. You don't have much luck with these things. No, it hits me once and you knocked in the air. He's not got any fire aspect to him, but Because it's raining. Just, yeah. Yeah. No, the golems are definitely out of all of them the most powerful. Mm -hmm. Hit wise. S screw the screw the grand fish. <laughs> Grand Fisher is surprisingly not as strong as I thought. I think it's just more the surprise. If you were to try and activate it on by accident. I mean, if we didn't have damage indicator on. If we didn't have damage indicators on, it wouldn't matter. Well, I mean, they are still noticeable. No, because but... I would have shaders on. Yeah, I do I guess. Yeah, well, I'm with you just in case the thing is still here. It's still here, then that's lucky. Even though he's the thing it killed us, but yes, it would be lucky if he was still here. <laughs> to ruin our day. No, he's not. Damn it. I mean, I guess it's a safety thing because obviously the hollow wrecks your ass. There's not much chance of you getting your stuff back. So, I guess that's why they get rid of them if they ever kill you. Right, we need to go hunt for a big cave or some shit. Another ravine. Because. But it's in right now, we need so much iron, and we don't have any. You know, it's just for armor and shit, or... I need obsidian too. Right, we need all this shit I'm mentioning. Okay, I'm my way look. I'm just killing more cows. Honestly, I see those dogs at the end of my fucking street. I wish I could rip their throats out. I'm guessing they bark a lot then, right? Oh, aye. And that's what gets him to bark, and then that's what gets him shouted at, and then that's what gets my mortis and that they start shouting. And when they start shouting, it's a pain in the ass because they won't stop. I see. Like a rising aggression level. Oh, yeah. Hey! You're lying down and doing it, you twat. I don't know why, but Zach used to stop really it. as well. Stop it. And for oh. some reason, after staying with Nan and Papa along with their dog, it was like a bearded collie that barked at the window every time a train went past. Yeah, basically, Zack became really loud. He used to bark a lot. I wonder. I, I, I've never figured out the connection between that and what that could have been. Well, then you're an idiot. I was joking. But as we all know, dogs have bad influences. Can I get up? Still haven't done that yet. What do you need it for? Toggle. Alright, we leave the vent on. No. Dig it off. What is wrong with it? It's rainy. So? Right, yeah. we have good enough computers for it not to play around with our frames. I have a better computer than you, remember? Yeah. And it's not playing around with my frames at all. It doesn't matter about playing a bit with the frames, it's just irritating. It's depressing. And the only reason we ever turned the rain off in the past was because of frame problems. No, I turned it off because it was annoying. We can't turn things off because they're annoying, so part of how we've got to play this. And plus, with this, the hollows and stuff can still spawn. Hmm, I need to make another pick. You have that diamond one, don't you? No, I don't have the diamond one. Where is it? It's down in the house. It shouldn't be in the house, it should be in my chest. No, it's in your chest, even. I class that, I class that mound of dirt as your house. So. It's not a house, it's just a little fort out in the island. 
Oh, there's that. Maybe it would be more interesting having this than making an actual house. Okay, I've got two stone picks. Where is said diamond pick? It's not here. It should be. It's not in my inventory. It's or my oh, chest. Yeah, I found it. Damn it, Sean. That's a creeper. Come on out and get a bunch of coal. That's another creeper. Oh, here comes the shaman. Why is it five freaking creepers? Are you kidding me? Yes, Stephen. Should creeper, do my job for me. Break the wall. Stephen, I think we could probably play this normal in the hollows. Would still spawn the same, maybe even more. I think they spawn more and hard. I mean, in normal or hard. Mm, I don't think they've classed them as mobs. I have no clue. So you played it on easy mode at one point. Back when it was more. I don't even say there was more, it's just it's felt it's around the same. The first day we spawn in the world, there seems to be more. Mm. There was once, like, crawling over fucking everywhere. Just, now, now there's just nothing. But damn, it's nothing. I'm going to take the diamond pick underground and I'm going to go look for a, a lava source if I can find one. Uh, I found one of those stone hill kind of things. What's so the there. Things? I think the stone hill and you get all like the coal on the top of it and stuff. What? Like an extreme house except all right. without all the dirt. Uh, it's, just a, it's just a mountain then. Skeleton. Although, actually need skeletons for arrows. They're pretty handy right now. Let's have a look down here. I'm pretty sure I've been here before. That's a creeper. And it's dead. Got a odd coal, that'll be enough, I don't know. Oh yeah. Coal's not really the issue. And fuel wise, we're doing fine. Mm. There's things to burn. We have none of. Even at that, we've got tons of trees. Yeah. I mean, I've got tons of wood to burn if I need to. <laughs> Make charcoal if you need to. All that crap, but yeah. As far as actual iron and stuff goes, we have like none. I if I've been in here before. Bark. I can hear your dogs down the streets now. Uh huh. Is that all day? Any dog? Any person? Anything? They, they bark. bark. So yeah, we, just want so attention. we, so we pop staffy and a bigger staffy. All right. I tend to run up this very narrow path that I made. And it's one of those households that just give off the bad, the bad name for staffies. It's one of those households. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm happy to talk trash about them. You're happy to talk trash about anyone. It's an even better point. Okay. Time. Sweet time. Come on, give me something. Give me a cave, give me a lava pool, give me something. Oh, I found a lava pool. You, have, you found lava. Found lava. A big ravine. Where the hell are you? I don't know. Honestly, if you wanted to find me, you would need to TP to me. But even at that, remember that I don't know the way back. So I wouldn't need to TP to you. Sorry, and I found lava. It may actually be a big lava ravine. I don't know. I've got a joint ravine, so. And a big lava ravine that's underground. Oh, hello, creeper. I see your head up there. Perfect. Come to me, Obsidian. But we need four bits for an enchant table. We have the leather. We have everything we else. We don't need to go to the nether either, so... We don't need to. We could, though. If we want to get anything out there. Like, like what? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe might, maybe holes will spawn there. Doubt it. It's worth oh, checking maybe. to see. But we need four leather. I mean, four obsidian to now, anyway. Maybe. Yeah, that's considered hell, though, so... Possibly. 
I, I don't consider it not a possibility for things to spawn in. Let's see if this works. Well, I'm getting a bunch of iron for this little ravine. Ah, oh, yeah. I'm just going to grab this obsidian. Got it. Got four. Oh, oh, hello, Mr. Creeper. You wanted me, didn't you? Ah, oh, well. Oh, You're dead now. Oh, the iron. God, I need, I need so much iron. I don't even have full iron armor. I don't, it would help us protect against just regular mobs, I think, crap, more than hollows, but it's worth getting. Any protection is worth getting. I know. We're at that stage right now where it's just they're, they're killing us so much. I, mean, I don't die very often. Oh, God. It has done it. Has done what? You know how I said how if you get your power up enough, it gives you a jump boost? Mm hmm. It's done that so it can't jump up a one space any high thing anymore. It jumps me slightly higher. It makes it like impossible for me to get in. Are you fucking serious? That's just gonna be editing. Have a quick gander over here. This is what stairs are for. So I'm gonna have to freaking use. I can, I can jump up things like that. Like what? I can't see. Remember? No, like. Stairs and stuff. I need to have an extra. I need basically need to make things three block high if I want to jump up th into them. What the fuck is that red thing in the distance? Yeah, it's gone. That was confusing. It's a grand fisher. It's fishing you in. No, no, no. No, I think I think it was just the game was con getting confused. That's all. Because it was the grand fisher. I think it was just a torch actually. I'm gonna make an enchant too while I've got the chance. Oh, uh, it means that if our jump abilities went up, that means our. Um, that means yours. Oh, yeah, but also the speed ability would have went up a slightly as well, so I should be able to run slightly quicker than what I did. It must be when you hit about 150, does it? Oh, I'm not too far off. Why are you in the cave, piggies? Ow, ah. ow. Right, I'm fighting four skeletons right now. You're dead. Well, they started fighting each other. You're not dead. Well, one and a half hearts. You're almost dead. Fighting four is a pain. I think one of them killed the other one, though, so I don't think it was alright there. No, that was another one. I just got gold helmet and boots from that. Impossible, can you make a little mining corridor? Thing. Or mining hole. A little creep. A mine hole, are ya? Mm hmm. Oh, I see. Oh, I think. That. There we go. Got 11 books. Oh shit, oh shit. Wait, what? I fell. Wait, what? what? Alright, you're in the ravine, aren't you? Yeah, I fell. Uh, Ryan, do you want to put the enchant table in the house for now? Uh, if you want. It'll probably be safe for the one out here. And I can finally answer this quick. Oh, yeah, I need to grab the, the bamboo stick. Let's see if I can enchant that bastard. Ow! Back. That zombie's got an iron sword. You think you're better than me, do you? I'll fight you and your crew. Come on, fight me. Come on then. And skeleton shoot. And all uh, zombies just spawned on top of them. Ah! Gotcha. Frick. Damn skeleton scum. Itchy head. No, you can't enchant them. Wait, what? You can't enchant any of the bleach stuff. Okay. I wasn't really caring because they're so far a lot stronger than most things we're using, so. 
Yeah. Well, at least I got some basic enchants on some of my armor to protect me a bit better. I'm, a gold, I'm wearing a gold helmet right now. I put one level on it and got unbreaking and um, thingy. It's what you kind of need for it, though. So, wouldn't be too disappointed. Yeah, but I got unbreaking plus protection. Good deal. Leggings got protect. Um, unbreaking iron plate chest plate got protection. And you are a weakened skeleton, and you're dead. Nothing else here. All right, Reaper. Well, I think that's enough time, so I think I'm going to end the episode now. Reaper. Oh my god, I look so fancy with my golden helmet on. Anyway, dude, I'm going to end this episode here. Should be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed the show. And Never. see you those next time. Wait, what? What? Nothing, then. Go and check out my Twitter and see you all later. Goodbye, everybody. Twitter.